Hey everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to set up the service calendar in Go High Level. Now, if you don't know who I am already, my name is Jackie. I'm just someone that's been starting an online business for the past year and succeeded. I am one of the top affiliates in Go High Level and it's definitely one of the softwares that I've used to take my agency to the next level. Now, of course, I have the 30 day free trial. I have the free courses. But what I really want to offer for all my affiliates that no one else is doing on the platform for Go Hello right now is one on one mentorship. Because I found that was so important and crucial to my journey when starting is having that mentor guide you, helping you set up the SaaS and the Go High Level accounts, asking questions and answering them. I'm going to be that person for you if you decide to go under my affiliate. Now, back to this service calendar topic. It is an absolute beast because this is a new feature that Go High Level recently rolled out and it solves so many of the problems that we used to have. And what it is, is look at this. This is an example of a nail salon and spa. And with the new service calendar, you can have different services, let's say eyebrows, nails, hair, haircuts, and create a calendar where you have separate bookings for different times, so one hour, and different costs, $55. And you can select them all differently and book them with different practitioners or the same practitioners. And what we used to have to do in order to create something like this is create multiple calendars, for example, a round robin calendar or an unassigned booking, and then group them all together. But with this new service calendar, you can do them all together under one calendar, which makes it so much easier. Now, how to turn this on is actually really simple, but a lot of people get it wrong. So follow these steps very closely. First, make sure you're in your agency view then go into settings. <coughs> Once you're in settings, you want to go into labs. From labs, scroll down, make sure you have this calendar service menu on. Now, before I toggle that on, I'm just going to show you that in my sub account right now, when I go create calendar, you see, I don't have a service calendar right now. But what I need to do is first toggle this on. Okay. Once that's toggled on, I need to go back into my calendars. I still had to have it on, but you need to go into preferences and under preferences, go into service menu, rooms and equipment. Turn those on and press save preferences. Perfect. Now that we've saved that, we're going to go back into calendars and, cre and click create calendar. And there it is, service calendar. Then you can go select and start playing around with it. Now, for anyone that doesn't know how to get into this calendar setting system, there's a few ways you can go into settings in your sub account and go into calendars, or you can go into the sub account here. You can go and press the calendar settings in here and it'll take you straight to the page that I was on. Now, I hope this has helped you. This is just a very simple tutorial on how to set up your service calendars. I'll be pumping out a new video on how service calendars work and showing everyone how to set that up step by step. So if you're interested in that, make sure that you subscribe and like so that you can follow more content like this. I hope this has helped you. Otherwise, I'll see you guys next time. God bless.